Their reference, the undisputed origins of Christ, is not illuminated by what we say in life, but how we live our life. I'm going to say that again. The, the light that truly represents the undisputed origins of Christ is not illuminated by what we say in life, but how we live our life. The light that shows the authenticity of Christ is the light that reflects the spirit of Christ. And Jesus says, you will know them by their fruit. I like that. I like that. He said, you're going to be able to know who's original by their fruit. And he goes on to tell us, as the man of God just spoke here, the fruits of the spirit. Our love, joy, peace, long suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, and kindness, and temperance. And, and to that end, uh, he's letting us know now, if you want to know the true, authentic Christians. I want you to, to go ahead and take a look at their fruit. I want you to know if they, if they have fruit that's coming from them that looks kind, if they have fruit that's coming from them that's gentle, if they seem to be one who's meek in their spirit, if they seem to seem one who, who's willing to suffer long, do they have genuine love? And I'm not talking about the kind of love that this world has. I'm talking about the kind of love that will love you when you don't love them. I'm talking about are they giving peace even when they're in the midst of an unpeaceful situation? Are they willing to be kind when you're not kind to them? I, that's when you're going to know if they're genuine, my Christians. They, are they willing to give of themselves and have faith when it seems like the uh, situation is one where faith can't be arrived? Genuine Christianity is one that comes from the inside. Is one that we should be able to display and folks ought to be able to take a look at us from afar and say, I don't care whether they pray or not, I can see that they're genuine. 